we have Ryan Middleton with the Katy Prairie Conservancy. Welcome. I'm from Katy, so awesome. howdy do. Hi. Glad Hi. to be here. Um, thanks for having us. Um, the Katy Prairie Conservancy is a nonprofit land trust. Um, we own about 20,000 acres um, on the Harris, Count Harris County, Waller County uh, border. Um, and we've been around since 1992 working to protect wildlife, um, prairies, wetlands. Um, That's fantastic. That yeah. fantastic. And part of your mission is outreach to help educate the mm -hmm. public about the creatures that are living among us. How many species of turtles are there in and around the Houston area? Oh, there's quite a few. Um, today we got four. Um, there's, I don't know, there's probably another dozen or so. Okay. Um, okay. For sure. And some, um, and some we can hold, others like the snapping turtle. We don't want to hold, correct? Mm -hmm. Correct. What would happen if we held a snapping turtle? Uh, you might lose a finger. Oh. oh. Not, right, no big deal, right? NBD, not a big deal. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so why don't we start uh, with the box turtle? Yeah. Is that one of these? Yeah. So we can, uh, we can open this up. Oh, they're so sweet. Yeah, so. I love turtles. These are, these are the ones that you'll see that people have uh, pets of and stuff as well. Um, so this is called an ornate box mm -hmm. turtle. Might is he going to hold he it might. like this? Yeah. Because oh, he might want to fly might. away? He, yeah, fly fly away. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's a joke. It's that'd a be, joke. That'd be cool if it could, right? <laughs> and what's really beautiful about this turtle is his eyes are orange. Yeah. So they kind of match the, the markings. Can I hold this one? Uh-huh. So that's, a, that's called a three-toed uh, box turtle. And what's neat about them is they have these little levers on the bottom here. So when they pull in, they actually close up. Oh, wow. And where are they normally found? Uh, so these are kind of upland turtles, mm -hmm. so you won't really find them in the water. Um, you'll find them crossing roads and uh, in the grass and all that kind of stuff. They're absolutely beautiful. And there's no reason that someone would need to be afraid of one of these creatures, right? No, ab absolutely not. Not one of these guys. They're, they're friendly. They're very friendly. Mm -hmm. And so where did your passion stem from? How did you get into this? Uh, so just growing up, uh, going to national parks and state parks and being outside, Boy Scouts, that kind of stuff. Um, and then, you know, got an opportunity to travel around and do some cool uh, biology work and, yeah. And if we're out in the neighborhood and we see one of these beautiful little creatures, well, I mean, what should we do? Like, let's say we see, see one in the road, trying to cross the road. Right, absolutely. So uh, if you see it crossing the road, you don't want to bring it back to where it was coming from. So if it's facing one way, help it across in the direction so, that it was moving. And it's okay to actually pick it up and, and move it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Wow, that yeah. is so I mean, cool. uh, you know, be careful. They don't want it to bite you or anything. Right, for sure. Mm -hmm. Now, um, when it comes to just, you know, endangered or anything like that, any problems with these types of turtles, or are they okay? Or the, These guys are fine. Um, there, are, there are some endangered um, turtles, but uh, not, not in this area. Um, there's one going on right now. There's a turtle called the chicken turtle. The chicken turtle. The chicken turtle that we're doing some pr really cool research on on our land right now. Oh, the um, chicken turtle. Yeah, it's got a fascinating name. Maybe and why? Maybe next time you could bring one of the chickens. <laughs> right, exactly. I'll, I'll talk to the researcher. Yeah. Were you going to ask why the name? Yeah, why, is why, why is uh, it the turtle? Apparently it tastes like chicken. Oh, yeah. interesting. Oh, that's horrible. I know. <laughs> Wow. You know, turtle soup and that kind of segment stuff. segment just I went guess. to a very dark place. <laughs> okay, Never don't, eat turtle don't soup. Close your ears. Yeah. Okay, let's move on to the next type of turtle. It's called a, a red ear slider turtle. Uh, I'm going to go with the snapping turtle the first. The snapping turtle. Oh, because oh. of how it's faced. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I don't want to reach in front of the snapping turtle. Does our insurance policy cover this segment? I'm just asking. <laughs> just putting that out there. Just putting that out there. So, with the snapping turtle, how big can they get? Uh, about this big. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude. Oh, wow. wow. Look at his. Look at, look at his wow. front little, little hands there. Yeah. Looks like he's just chilling. Yeah. So it, this is an aquatic one, so you can see how the it's got webbed feet there. Those ones mm -hmm. don't. Okay. And where would got we it. find a snapping turtle in Houston? Uh, I'm anywhere that there's water, probably in perennial waters. So I mean, you'll find them in the in creeks and um, bayous. bayous and mm -hmm. that stuff. Huh. You'll, you'll even catch them crossing the road too. Oh, you're kidding. Yeah. Because I'm pretty sure when I was a kid, we had two, Noah and Connie, and they were snapping turtles. They were very tiny. Yeah. But there was a point where my dad had to put them in the bayou because yeah. they were a little aggressive. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, absolutely. There, I mean, this long tail that this one has and just the size of it, what are the telltale signs? Like if someone comes across one of these, how, how do they know it's actually a snapping turtle? Um, so, I mean, one of the one feature is this. They kind of have almost like a Bowser-like shell. Oh, oh, there you oh. go. There you go. Oh, what? There you go. That's it snapping. Oh. So. <laughs> and, what, what, and what happened that upset it? Oh, probably just being held. Held? 
So they don't like to be held, really handled much. Yeah. Oh man. Okay. Well, we'll let you put him yeah. back well, in his uh, back home. Yeah, and and space. just about out of time. Friendly but if turtle. we could get that red ear slider yeah. turtle, <laughs> that one's not gonna bite you, right? No, it no. is not. It is. Have you ever been bitten before? I have not been bitten. Okay. Well, I hope let's not keep to it be. that oh, way. And when the snapping turtle snaps, it clamps down and doesn't let go. Is that the way? Right. It works? Right. Right. So we don't. Yeah, we don't want that to happen. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> the red red ear slider. This is beautiful, especially the underside of this turtle. So colorful. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, and it's got, if its head will pop out, it does have a little red ear right on it, which is how it gets its name. And would these be found also just all over, all over the city? Yeah, these are really common, absolutely. It's beautiful. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for sharing. And for people who'd like to maybe take their kids or their family members, uh, where can we find y'all and where do we go? Uh, yeah, if you go to katieprairie.org is our website. And uh, we have events like this, um, wildlife opportunities and that kind of stuff out at our uh, Indian Grass Preserve uh, directions and, um, and all that can Very be found nice. on our website.